I'm selling my PlayStation 4, so I need to wipe out all the data, all the information off there. I'm going to completely factory reset, and I'm going to show you today how to do this. But before I do, I'd really appreciate it if you could uh, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It would really help me out and help the channel grow, and I can bring more content like this for you guys. Thank you so much. Now, let's go begin. So you want to go all the way to the right, you see here. So you're going to go to that suitcase settings, case things there. Click on that one. You're going to scroll down to the bottom. And you're going to go to initialization. You see at the very bottom there, hit that. Then you want to go to initialize the bottom one again. Initialize PS4. Now you've got two options here. One, quick quickly delete data from system storage and initialize a PS4. This method might allow third parties to retrieve the data by using specialized tools. Now I definitely don't want that. So if you go to full, completely delete from system storage and initialize a PS4. This method takes several hours. So that's the one I'm going to go for. So I'm going to start that now. All users and all data will be deleted. This PS4 will be deactivated for any users who have it activated as their primary PS4. So you go cancel on the left, go over to the right and initialize, and there is starting. So it's got one of two things to do, deactivating. So I'll be back. Okay, if you initialize the PS4, all users and all data will be deleted from it. This operation takes several hours. Are you sure you want to continue? After you select yes, the PS4 will automatically restart and initialize, will restart, will start. So go to yes and let's begin. There we go. So I let that run and PS4 will come on and off a few times and that's how it's going to be. Okay guys, I'll be back in a moment. So this is the first screen that's come up and as you can see it says remaining time 4 hours. Okay guys, it's a big hard drive as well, it's the one terabyte PS4 so. Yeah, I've just got to make room and this PS4 is not going to get used anymore. So, yeah, it's just sitting there. I play my PS5 more and I've transferred all the data, games, everything over there. Oh, now remaining time, three hours. So that was a quick jump. All right, guys, when it finishes, oh, now remaining time, two hours. All right, it might do it quicker than I expected. So obviously it's working out and moving and deleting stuff faster than we expected. So, guys, after three hours, roughly, it has finally finished. So this is exactly how your PlayStation 4 will be when you first start it. Okay, so now you need to start asking you to connect your controller with the cable and sync everything and then go in and go through the start process. Logging in, PlayStation Plus con um, membership, email if you have and all those and so on. And then you'll get the latest updates and so on. So hopefully guys, you found this useful. Thank you so much for watching and coming to the end if you've reached this far. Remember to subscribe, it really helps the channel grow and hit that like button. Those two things are the main things. It's free and it will only take you a couple of seconds. Until next time, take care, catch you soon, bye for now.